the final round, the decisive round. What we saw before as headshot again. All right. It's one on one. Q bait and Clutch Master. Clutch with 12 health, but he gets the bomb down. Clutch is watching Cafe. That is where Q bait is coming from. Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy Kim Clinic here with another video. And today I have a great tournament match for you guys. It's King of Rising versus Local Squad and this match was intense. Uh, great players, great clutches, great plays. I really recommend to watch till the end because this match was really intense. Other than that, I have to say, if you're new to the channel, subscribe because I'm actually one of the first to always upload about the new things coming to Critical Ops. So for example, new skins, new modes, new maps, new futures, everything doesn't matter. Just um, I'm really one of the first to upload. So if you want to stay up to date with Critical Ops, I really recommend to subscribe so you don't miss out anything. Add me on CEOPS if you haven't. Here's my username. I might accept you. I accepted some other people. So feel free to send me a friend request. I might accept. Yeah, other than that, you can check out our discord and twitter in the comment section as a pinned comment and yeah enjoy the rest of the gameplay and hopefully i'll see you guys in the next video peace three to one headshot um pushed all the way up here doesn't even need to plant the bomb as they get the kill with the grenade and uh three oh for the next one but he's gonna be using the ak get some damage onto onto cubate but can't actually get the kill Cubate turns around and takes him out and then finds a headshot across the map onto energy. Incredible shooting there from Cubate, and now it is all up to get on my level. Yeah, with no snipers, it's hard for them to hold their position from a long distance there. You see a oh, nice job, King Dogo. Empire does get the plant over at B. Yeah, I mean, it's evenly matched. A nice push onto B side uh, that's going to help King Uprising. With this plant, they, they can get a few more shots here. Strong does find two. Uh, Kubei finds Strong. Energy is going to finish this off. Now he's just got to defuse. He's got plenty of time. Uh, and finally, a round going over to Loco Squad. And just like that, Kubei finds himself a double kill, taking out Clutch Master as well. Two Ooh. on one. Get on my level! A triple kill! Unbelievable! Yeah, and now it's a 1v1, and uh, plenty of time for King Uprising to plant the bomb. They're not in a rush. Uh, he still to get to the bomb. He has to get to it, but he's got time. But with that kind of play, uh, get on my level, looking to come in clutch here uh, yet again. There's some smoke down. We're on B-side. Kubei uh, knows to kind of look through the smoke. He's actually walking through. This is pretty dangerous for him. He doesn't have vision, but he does get the headshot, and Kubei is taken out. Wow. 3-2 to two in favor of Loco Squad. Headshot with another clutch kill to even uh, to took keep this grenade close. though. Took yeah. a grenade, took a lot of damage off of that. He's going to be trying to run back towards the spawn. He's in a tough spot because he knows that he's pretty sure they know where he is as the grenade comes out behind him. And so QB and headshot both can be playing very carefully. A nice shadow. Grenade. Oh, shadow back and headshot takes him out from a cross huge kill over on the other bridge. And now it's going to be headshot rushing over to a there is nobody here. This is a free bomb site that he is going to be able to plant at and will energy and get on my level be able to respond to this. Oh, they are just completely in the opposite side of the map here. They're, they're rushing as fast as they can. Oh, Cubate with a huge shot. 2v1. It looks like we may have a pickup. Headshot gets on my level, and just like that, we finally have another round after a four-run streak by Loco Squad. All right, so B-side rush here from Loco Squad on this first round of the second half. It gets spotted out, but the King, King cannot react to it quite in time to stop the plant. Now they have to try and retake. It's a four on four. Has a couple of kills coming out now all of a sudden. Lots of kills. And it is going to be a two on three. King getting the upper hand now on this retake attempt. And it's just two on one now. Can it get clutched? No, it can't. Very nearly by get on my level. But headshot gets the final kill. Will start Ooh. off the second half with a King victory. Oh, that's not a good grenade. Get on my level. Accidentally hits himself with the grenade. Hopefully that doesn't come back to bite him, but 
They are still trying to push in. Cubate gets that easy kill. He was only on 11 health. And this is a huge two-man kill and a lead. We actually haven't seen Uprising play with any advantage for the last few rounds. So mm -hmm. to get a man advantage here, this point in the game, this is critical. They cannot give another round and go to match point uh, without being in a really dire state. So uh, plus, nice to see Cubay get back on the board here. Uh, so look, nice job. Empire finds energy. So another solid kill. And at five versus two, Empire finds. Uh, although doesn't doesn't get the kill. Cubay though. Looking to shoot across the bridge here. Yeah, Empire finds strong and with that assist. So, this great, great play so far. Very clean round from King they Uprising. needed that. Yeah, they did. Needed that badly. Another kill. Really like how uh, King Uprising has done a better job on the aggression. Get on my level looking to try to find something through the shot. Headshot finds strong. Strong out is out of the game. But get on my level going for this uh, A-side bomb plant very quickly. But Cubate comes in. They get the plant, but look at Cubay. He has just torn up this side, and that is another round going over to King Uprising. It is now match point for Loco Squad, looking to claim first place, claim those 100 points for the qualifiers in their first cup here. They just go with the one U ratio on the headshot. It looks to be the case. Clutchmaster gets taken down, and Empire finds one as well. Finds two now. And Looks like King not ready to pack it in just yet. They make it 10 to 12. So this is interesting because we've seen uh, King be, like you said, streaky. And unfortunately, though, it's not a streak that lasts more than four or five rounds, right? Or So so they, are, they have to make three rounds to tie it up. And they got the one, so they need two more. That's a pretty oh, tall order. Shot to 12, one more round, and we will go the distance for King Uprising. Take a look at the guns purchased. I don't see, actually get on my level is only on a pistol. I see a submachine gun. This is not going to be a good round for members of Loco Squad. Their economy is in shambles, and two of them have fallen right off the bat. Ooh. They try and rush onto A, but they don't have the bomb on them anymore. They need to go back into a dangerous situation in order to pick that up. So King Dogo, he had great positioning and eyes. Uh, threw mm -hmm. some fires into the uh, into the tunnel. Got a kill. And it is now all up to Clutchmaster. He's not going to be able to do it. And we are tied, Dragonborn. 12 rounds apiece. Oh the final round, the decisive round. It's this full buys across the board. It is incredible. Tasty. I mean, all right. So we've seen it. The team that gets the first kill typically is, finds a way to make the win. So what we saw before, as headshot again. All right. This oh, is double. This is looking wow. good. Unbelievable. What a shot, but Strong does answer one, does take out headshots, so they don't have to worry about that U ratio unless someone picks it up. Now over Strong and get on my level, each finding a kill. King just takes out, get on my level, but falls to Clutchmaster. It's one on one. Q bait and Clutchmaster. Clutch with 12 health, but he gets the bomb down. All right, this is huge. Clutchmaster's got 12, like you said, very low health. Q bait is full 100 100 on the armor and health mm -hmm. apiece, so he can. But he, he does not have the clock on his side. No, he doesn't. So he just needs to get the kill in. He's got a few seconds yep. left. Cafe. Clutch is watching Cafe. Clutch is watching Cafe. That is where Cubate is coming from. Oh! oh! He doesn't find him in time. Cubate with the kill will get the defusal. And that this is will close. be King Uprising in the is it? closest Woo! match we have seen in these cups. Taking the finals. Another 100 points, oh, wow. guaranteeing themselves the number one seed in the qualifier next month. Unbelievable. Oh, tasty. That was that was the closest kill right at the end because that defuse was barely in time. That was uh, that flashing red light was almost ready to go. The bomb was about ready to set off. He needed that kill at that moment, and that was, that was intense. Yo, what is up guys, it's Kubo here, just wanted to say a couple of words before the end of this video. Um, me, as the leader of Kings, and everyone in Kings would like to thank you guys for the continuous support on every video, on Twitter, on Discord. We recently reached uh, 3,000 members, and I'm trying to do a little something special for you guys because of that and our twitter keeps on growing as well so thank you guys without you guys we wouldn't be where we are right now and we will try our best to keep winning those tournaments you know esl alliance 
and to be the best at the game and i hope to see at least some of you guys at LAN if we qualify in LA thanks and peace